We are developing a product called Pillow Talk that connects couples in long distance relationships. So the way it works is each person has a wristband, they wear to bed at night and a, a speaker from inside their pillow. So the wristband picks up your heartbeat and sends it via smartphone app to the other person's pillow. So when you're in bed at night you can, you can hear your partner's heartbeat. Um, this here is a prototype, so this doesn't look that good at the moment. And then this is a 3D print of what the finished design is going to look like. So each person will have one of those. It's really simple, it just uses a light and a sensor and it just measures the change in density in your arm when, you're, when your blood pulses. I studied interaction design at university and I was looking at how people communicate with each other using technology and I realised that existing methods of communication are all very two-dimensional and they're all screen based so all the ways we have at the moment to interact with people like Facebook where you can video call them on Skype they're all they all require active participation so you have to be there and you have to be present in the in the in the communication whereas when you're actually with someone physically you can come home and you can sit in the same room as someone and be connected to them but not have to actively engage with them so I wanted to come up with a way to use technology to feel a sense of presence of the other person without having to engage with them well, the reason I ended up doing it, it was started as my university project and it got picked up by a technology blog and quickly went viral on the internet. So I started getting all these emails from people asking where they could buy it. So I thought, well, if, you know, if you guys want to buy it, I'll make it. So, um, yeah, the reception's been phenomenal. Being a hardware startup in the UK is actually really difficult. I don't think the UK has the same approach to, to innovation in the hardware sector the way that the United States does, which is partly why I'm here. Uh, it's been a bit of a struggle to get to, get to this point.